Hello everybody, hope you're all okay. I've decided to eventually do a video on this scale electric. Remember I, I mentioned I was going to do a scale electric track. It's about biggest I can get in here this area might as well use the space up and only full of junk cleared that out and got some cars we'll have a look at them I've just done a flat track um, nothing dramatic it's mainly a racing Get some speed. I've not put any bridges in or anything. There's a few areas where, like a chicane, a track narrows. And there's a couple of areas where you actually change tracks, one there and one over there and you have to have two in so when you come past the finishing line you're on the same track as what you started on I put a couple of LED strips in it's a bit of a lighting effect Usually when my brother comes up we have races round. But thanks to this little gadget here, you can actually time your laps. So you can try and beat your best time. So you don't actually have to have someone to race with all the time. You keep trying to beat your best time on the laps. two controllers that came what I did bought a set and then just bought some extra track to just make it a little bit bigger and this is 12 foot by 4 foot and the only thing with these is the the lead is not a very long lead so I've extended the lead so you, you, it's, it's quite tight but when, when you, once you extend the lead you've got a lot more lead than to and those familiar with scale actually you just press the trigger and the car on the, that's how you control your speed and that's it That, that there gives you an option to put it on, if children are playing with it, you can put it on a lock so that they can't pull this trigger fully and have the cars just flying off. So they actually have to control it. You have to teach children to do that. Children tend to just normally the trigger right in, of course it'll just fly off at the bend. But obviously I don't use that. So I started buying some cars, we'll have a look at them. thing is they stack on top of each other you show our space these came with the set they're just basic cars um, no lights on them or anything yeah, they're not the type of car I'd buy but obviously they came with the set 
and all the modern cars now have magnets in them which helps keep them on the track but you can see the difference between ones that you get with a set and ones you buy separately and there's not much to these these all have lights the modern ones now come with lights uh, let's just move out of the way and we'll have a look you'll notice I've put a carpet down this is MDF here and the reason is I was running it without this and they actually pick shavings wood up just there where the braids are I've no idea why but putting this old carpet down over the top of the MDF eliminates that I don't get any fluff or bits of MDF there now that's why I did it so maybe MDF's not the perfect thing for this unless you put some carpet down alright let's have a look look at the cars you get these are obviously all modern ones um, I need two hands to open it down a minute okay well, they come in a nice case of information on the Nice case that keeps the dust off. There's the okay, again they got the magnets in which helps keep it on their track. These have lights front and rear. Much better cars these. And they usually cost about £40 brand new. You sometimes get them a little bit cheaper, just say £35 or something. That's brand new. Which isn't bad value, really. And if you're going to look after them, they're going to last quite a while. You have a motor underneath here. These braids pick up the current. Motor turns, it's usually the back wheels connected to the motor. Simple. And then the lights are on a circuit board. Small circuit board, LEDs. And this is the Porsche 911. Is now you've seen one in this case. Um, this is a Ferrari oh, from the 60s, maybe. Again, lights on the front and back. Jaguar again be early sixties this one at E type You notice they all all have drivers in as well, there's always a driver in. Mm, 
BMW Because they just stack on top of each other. So you can build a nice tower. And this is a Honda Civic. You see the driver there. And you don't have to put these numbers or anything on them, it's all printed on for you. This is how they come, do you know how to mess about? Say so they're all these days, it's all printed, not paper. It's actually printed on the body. So then, they're new ones. I do have one. Old one. I will show you this one. This is from the... 1970s and it's, uh, it's the old black Lotus John Player special I've got this one second hand obviously can't get these now these don't have the magnets in they're quite difficult to keep on the track because the magnets help obviously and there's the mold so you can see the motor there see how that motor spins connected to the back wheels and this is in fantastic condition for its age and when my me and my brother were young we used, he used to have this that's why I got it I remember playing with his scale electric and we used to race with this and I think it was a red Ferrari he had similar type F1 car and these these are quite tough you have to be careful with them to keep keep them on the track So that's the only second hand one I've got. And this is a modern version of that. So I'll just put this down again. Again, it's the same car, gem player, different number, gem player special, but the modern. They did a modern version of it, and this does have the magnet. This is like a special edition that they did. So this is a bit easier to control. So it's the magnet. This came out a few years ago, I think. Limited to five thousand.
Mm, so what we'll do, we'll get some going round. Uh, what I'm going to have to do is put the camera tripod. Um, it's going to be difficult to hold the camera and the controller and keep me eye on the car. So I'll, put, I'll set it up on a tripod and we'll have a look at some of the cars going round. I'll be back with you shortly once I set it up. Right, I think this is the best type of angle for it. and then there's the best time 3.6 so you you decide how many laps you want to set I, I set it at 4 so I did 4 laps and it records your fastest lap time which was 3.6 So I need to try and beat that. So what we'll do, we'll do four laps again. We'll try and beat that time. Okay, we'll record our fastest lap. Point two, so that's better than last time. You can just keep trying to beat your own best time. And it's a great addition. This you don't get this with the set. Well, I didn't. You get a mechanical lap counter, uh, so you don't know that just counts your laps. It doesn't give you a a time so I bought this because obviously you not only counts your laps but you get your your time really the, the, you should have these in all sets <laughs> but I just bought this separately it wasn't expensive it was about £12 well worth it. A few other things I've added like these flags. Um, you know, you used to get them years ago, but you don't get them now. So I bought them. This type of fencing. Um, which you don't get now. It just clips to the trap. You get this modern type now you see the difference it's modern type of fencing so I bought some old fencing and on the old fencing you have 
part where you can put a flag in. Whereas the new fencing, there's no there's no holes to put flags in. You see, I mean, you could always glue some flag poles to it, but. Yep, so that's my scale electric setup. Obviously, in the centre here, I'll probably buy some stands with spectators on. Um, bridge or something going over. <coughs> I say nothing at the moment in the centre. Just build that up a bit. Okay, another thing I didn't show you yet is when you buy these, they actually get spare braids with them at the bottom there as you can see. When you buy these new, you get a couple of spare braids. Okay, well, thanks for watching and that's how I thought I'd show you because I did mention show you once I built it up. Obviously it's not anything like the model railways you've seen that. That takes priority but it's just something different isn't it? Okay, bye everybody, take care.